rehearsal a couple hours before the show, uh, oh I sat in front of Bruce and he said, uh, I understand from Dave, Dave McKinnon was my, is my boss or was my boss. Yeah. He said that you write a few songs. I said, well, yeah, but, well, what do you want to play? And I went out, I was playing some James Taylor stuff. He said, no, that's really good, but, but I hear that you, like I say, you write some stuff. And I said, well, yeah, but, you know, come on, really. He said, no, no, I, I, I heard a little bit of one song, you can play it for me. And this is what they played. My, Part way through it, he said, "Okay, it's a songwriter circuit. You got to play that one. You got to play that one." That's good. No so, way. Great. This is what we played the first time I played on stage with Bruce. So. And you already know the backup story to this about it was uh, after Stan Fest and. No, it was after a cruise. No, I, well, I, I think it was Stan Fest, but either way, it was much of <laughs> And I looked for this and I couldn't find it. Took an afternoon off work and we wrote it. <laughs>
a couple of hours in a studio, oh, and literally, it was, don't get me wrong, it wasn't Dave Gunning's studio or whatever, right? But we, we found the studio in Halifax that we could afford, and he had never ever been in a studio before, and Dave has got probably eight or ten songs that he's written. And uh, anyway, laid down the tracks, and uh, I put together a, a, a really nice video of, of him singing yeah, some of these songs. Sense, but got really lucky on the video actually let's yeah. bring it all together and that's also on youtube so if you ever look up dave kerr you'll see some of the stuff on there the second year bruce asked me back for the